Good! OG Parling. <laughs> we don't have morning, we don't have night, we only have OG Parley. Therefore, it's good OG Parling Moon, good OG Parling, and good OG Parlight. Okay? Right. It is your girl, OG Parley. <laughs> she, she. Aha. Let's get it. I greet you all in the wonderful name of 2020. Aha. This is like the second official video that I am filming this year. Um, yes. <laughs> anyway, so as you can tell by the title of this video, um, yeah. So I'm gonna talk about like getting an um nominated for an award. And I just want to show you guys my new intro. <laughs> but before all of that, I'd like to say, like, uh, you know, welcome to the new decade. Welcome to the new year. You know, like, an I've I've managed, guys. I can't just, you know, here we talk first. And, um, yo, yeah, you see the smile. It took a lot for the smile to get on. But before that, can we just take a look at this beautiful hair? Okay. This hair right here is from You and Hair. It was a gift from You and Hair. You can find them on Instagram. Um, many influence have received hair from you and hair if you haven't already noticed. Yeah, it's kind of their thing to send hair to influencers. But yeah, uh, we're not an influencer, we're OG party things. Ha! Anyway, um, yeah, and then these amazing lashes. Bo, bo, bo. They're from um, um, South African Hair Emporium, you know, like my Sheen Emporium where I get all my beautiful hair dyes. <gasps> yeah! Oh, and guys, actually, I feel like I want to show you guys my dyes from South African Hair Emporium. You know what I'm saying? So you guys can, like, go and support a black business and also use those dyes as well because it's it's affordable and very accessible. Do you know what I'm saying? I have all my dyes. I keep them in this box over here. And then I also have, like, my activators for when, um you know, like, I want to play with my brother's head. I will insert a short film of me over here where I was playing with my brother's head. Yeah, I was coloring his hair. Fail because he didn't want to bleach it, but it did color <laughs> somewhere along the line. So in here, firstly, these are my activators. So I'd mix them with the hair dye when I want to like color real live human hair. Like the hair that grows from our scalps. You can do that. Leave a brush cut or whatever. Find the hair dead. So you can do that. You just need to bleach your hair because it works better on like um platinum blonde hair. Bleach hair vibes, you know. But anyway, let me just quickly show you guys all the colors that I have before just going into everything else. Because I just feel like it's really interesting. I'm going to be trying out so many colors this year. Like, uh, yeah. This is how many... I cannot believe my eyes. I cannot believe my eyes. <laughs> I also can't believe my eyes. I have about 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 16 hair colors. And then I have three that are not from here. So I have about 19. <laughs> um, so over here we have orange. Is it orange? It's like an orange red. If anything, I think it matches my outfit. <laughs> I'll show you two at a time so we can go by quicker. We have like a dark purple, a dark purple and a yellow. Uh, I hope I don't look the same color twice. Because I'm doing a bit stupid, but yeah. And then we have like a powder purple and a powder blue. Powder purple, powder blue. Um, <clears throat> I think I should, no I didn't. Oh, I have two, I have two types of, that was a, a baby purple. This over here is a lilac and this is a red. This red, I used some of it. Yeah, so this red is when we were attempting to dye my brother's head. I'm saying attempting because we didn't fully go forward with it, but uh, we, we did dye his hair, but we were not finished. Yeah, and this is like a bright orange, and this is like a lighter based purple. I have like three purples, so it's not the same one. Yeah, and then we have, um, let me show you like this. Yeah, okay. So then we have this one. This is like pink. We have that pink. We have blue and green. Mm hmm Okay. This is the tricky part. What didn't I show you? I think I didn't show these four. Yeah. And then I have this powder pink and this like powder turquoise. And then... And then I have this like dark purple and then this other like... It's not purple. It's like, it's like a violet neon purple pink going on. They're not the same color, okay? 
as you can see they're not the same color and then the other colors that i have um i have obviously bleach to color the hair bleach the hair well <laughs> and then i also have like you know like uh like these colors yeah like natural normal colors um and yeah so uh, and on top of that on that note so someone commented in one of my comments let me tell you something i read all my comments even the bad ones that i do take away because some are very offensive to certain people in the video um someone said what did they say again she said something like in 2020 can you please not have hair videos let me tell you something about my hair videos i'm a wig enthusiast it is my job I work with hair companies and I get paid for it so you will be seeing hair videos if you don't want to watch them don't click on them baby just wait for my vlogs baby because I'm securing the bank not the bag so you're gonna get hair videos okay thank you very much for your patience and your time and everything and your support ah, okay so let's move into uh, <laughs> me getting nominated I'm gonna leave best for last uh, so me getting nominated for this award so earlier on in January on the 9th on the 8th on the 8th uh i was admitted into hospital right and i had an operation and i only got out th that was a tuesday i got out on the saturday today is about 11 days from that so like my recovery i must say i am in like 10 i'm 90 percent healed let me say that um yeah so it's not like ah you're in hospital you have operation and you're so hyper babes can't kill the personality babes look look we give we give we give let the whole train move four were the the boom feel me cool so um yeah and so the day after right so i got admitted like uh i'm not gonna go in depth about why and what happened in here nah but i got admitted i was in the hospital on the tuesday night like evening like my seven and you know hospitals guys public or free, private me i think the public ones take longer but even the private ones take time i only got like processed at like 1 a.m so i was only officially like with if it did like yeah but like i had like my drips and everything on the tuesday and then my operation was on the morning on the wednesday at like eight in the morning huh no it was at like 11 in the morning i had moved kept moving the times kept moving because i was like uh you need to go for this immediately so they had to squeeze me in ah, I'm ready. yes that's my throat is dry and i took a lot so it's not helping but i might just end up drinking um activator um okay mm -mm, wait okay it's fine uh yeah and so you know like when you're on anesthetics and so many painkillers guys you get high for these meds like on a serious note like you're not yourself like i was floating <laughs> though i was i was uh, you know like i felt very like i was lit yeah and then i get this like a notification i don't remember if it was an email or an instagram dm i don't remember because i was high <laughs> over meds and yeah and anesthetics and things and then i get this like you um nominated thingy uh we're gonna nominate you for and then i'm like nyan but nyan babes nyan and i was like ah but I wasn't in my right state of mind, so like I kind of forgot. So like I forgot about it, right? I only showed like one person, I think. Yeah, and but like the focus was not these nominations. Like this girl is going to an operation. I think I got it after the operation because I remember I was too dizzy. I couldn't understand. Well, Mara, I knew what was happening, but I could sure. It could have been a dream. And then like days later, say now, uh, <clears throat> on that Wednesday after my operation, so I was like high for the whole day basically and then maybe like let's say friday so you know it gets very 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 boring in the hospital and i was in a certain ward where you only had certain types of visitation hours um and this ward i don't want to give it away but like there, it's a certain ward where there's certain people in there for different things but related in the same places or whatever i think you can say and people had different visitation hours i only had like an i had, I had two hour visitations every day and they were like one was shh, it was annoying just know that so i was always alone you know like because i wasn't that one where this one could have visitation for 10 hours because of a certain situation do you know what i mean so i was very bored so hey buddy she's here she's here she's here hey i bump into a photo and then i'm like hey man i can show that's as i click when i click i'm like hey so it was real and then i remembered and i'm like baby girl baby girl baby girl baby girl but also i was excited but i was still like very like down you know like in the hospital it's a very very depressing environment i'm so sorry and you know without painkillers like you're in excruciating pain it's very depressing 
in essence, take care of yourselves, be healthy, like, do not find yourself getting admitted. It's not nice. And I know I used to be like, oh, I'm in a good hospital, I'm in a good hospital. Yay! I don't want to go there anymore. My child will be born in the bath in my mother's house. I'm joking. The child will be born. I'm thinking of, like, water birth in my own house. Yeah, my home. After I've been in my home. Yeah, no, I'm not for hospitals at all. I hate them, if anything. I want nothing to do with them. I had a very bittersweet experience also, like, you know, like, mm-mm. So, yeah. So I was a lot on my phone. So as much as I was excited for this award, I was also like, Ish. <sighs> yeah, I guess, you know, I couldn't concentrate because like, you know, I have a lot on my plate. I'm, all, I'm like, you, okay, how are we going to do this? Because I've never actually like done, uh, like being nominated for things and stuff like that. But uh, so last year, there's a certain vlog that I did do where I attended these awards. Like uh, they invited me to come. So I came. And I showed out because look, huh? Only to find out that the next year I was going to be nominated as a fashion icon of the year, you know. And I was like, oh yes! And then I also got nominated for influencer of the year, and I was like, oh, <laughs> kill two birds with one stone. Yeah, and yeah. So I was seeking help from a certain friend of mine that's in PR, um, Creative Corner. Shout out to Creative Corner. Yes, yes. <laughs> and uh, I was asking like yo my dog look this is what happened how do I go forward I don't know what to do so yeah um I got advice and whatever 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 so then I decided I knew how I was gonna move forward and everything I was very scared I was not even I don't get scared but yeah yes I was scared you guys I was like you mm -mm. I was and also like the anxiety you know I have anxiety until June basically why what I'm saying is voting lines are open from now to June but I need to vote the most right now because only the top 10 get to um in each category um get to like fully compete until june and then they count and whatever so i'm just like okay how are we gonna do this so then yeah no but eventually like i got excited like, i accepted it and everything and there was a certain day today is Today's currently Sunday. So somewhere within this week, that's when I decided I'm putting this poster out. I'm putting this out, you know. I was in a good mood. My spirit was uplifted because I was, like, on bed rest for a very long time. I couldn't move. I couldn't do anything for myself. Literally, my mom had to, like, watch me. Like, guys, stay out of hospital. If you know it's good for you. <laughs> Unless you like it, you know. There's people that have weird, like, um, <laughs> fetishes and whatever. So I hate hospitals, so. So yeah, and yeah, so your girl got nominated for the Zero One Man Awards 2020 um, for Influence of the Year and Fashion Icon of the Year. Now guys, Skank Katakamalala, look, we both, we all know, not be, look, all off, all off, we know that, yeah, when Polly shows out, ah, she shows out, babes. <laughs> ha, yes, yes. And um, yeah, like, I would be truly like, sincerely full-hearted, whole-hearted blood from head to toe thankful to the highest degree one of the epitome of thankfulness um be so like truly like grateful honored thankful and everything if like all the people watching this video could kindly please take a time out of their day to vote for me this is uh i don't know if it's open i don't think it's open outside of south africa it's only for south africans to vote i'm gonna assume but even if you're not in south africa try try until they tell you no you feel me yeah so i'm just gonna tell y'all so basically for influencer of the year if you want your girl to an influencer they here um please kindly sms 011 it's og parley to the number 35029 okay that's for the influencer one and then for fashion icon honey you're going to be smsing 011 og parley okay to 35029 so for fashion icon it's it's Okay, it's 011 OG Parley and an influencer, it's 011 It's OG Parley. So it's two different SMSs. So I'm going to insert an example over here and over here for both of them. Okay. Great. <laughs> um, yeah. And yeah, please just kindly vote for me. Um, an SMS is three rand. Um, that's the catch, you know, like, unfortunately, you can't use free SMSs. Like, you know, these things don't work and everything. Matter guys, we vote for idols and stuff like that. So let's vote for OG Party, you know what I'm saying? And I'm also into, like, uplifting people this year. Like, you know, like, supporting people and everything. Not spoon-feeding people, but supporting you. Do you know what I mean? Like, for instance, I'm open to, if you are an artist or something, and your music is not copyrighted, of course, and you do not plan on copywriting it soon, because I will remove it. 
um send through your music you know and we can you know in a vlog we can use it as the backtrack do you know what i'm saying if you are selling certain types of things send them to me and you know like i'll do unboxings and stuff like that um yeah man you know so we can uplift each other and expose each other to each other as well because you guys it's about mutuki mutu kamutu kabatu mutu kimutu kabatu yeah that's one anyway <laughs> yeah and then uh this brings me over to my new intro so i had somebody from the states she created an intro for me it's the intro that you saw at the beginning of this video. <laughs> it's the intro that I'm going to show you again. Maybe it's at the beginning. I don't know. Maybe I feel like being juicy and not putting it. <laughs> and then I'll put it like, yeah, I'm not going to put it. I'm not going to put it. But anyway, I'm going to watch the video and react to it. Um, and then I'll also put it in here so you guys can react with me. Okay. So that is my new intro for 2020 or for a certain amount of time until I feel like I want to change my intro. I think every year you must start afresh with something, you know, different. So unfortunately, you might not be hearing Um, Yeah, but, you know, growth comes with change. So... And another thing, you know when someone sends you a photo of someone that looks like you and you're like, but she was in a Bentley, I was in a Rolls Royce, so I can see that we are not the same. I see it, but I don't see it, like if I look really fast. But anyway, um, yeah, um, like I really like the intro, like it's so cute, like you know, like I like the aesthetic and everything. I feel like it represents like Bukala Bagaro, like my personality and everything, because like I'm bummy. I don't know what that was. You can hear that. Cool. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, basically, um, yeah. I think uh, that's all I have to say for the intro. Um, one thing there, like, when people make things for you and whatever, and you have to pay or you don't pay or whatever, I just want you guys to always remember your worth, know who you are, because people are going to disrespect you out here. They're going to waste your time and your paying client listen to me right now i'm not going to mention the restaurant i'm not going to mention the situation or whatever no the situation i'm tell you but not the restaurant so there's a certain meal i had at a certain place i don't know if you're watching this don't say where it was <laughs> there was a certain meal that i had yes <laughs> it was lovely scrumptious if anything and i was like oh I'm gonna just gonna be my spot you feel me and it isn't like far from like campus where i stay not here but like where i stay and i'm like oh but when i'm lazy yo we're within yo we are, we are within i'll even put a budget aside for this restaurant shop because it's not that it's cheap cheap it's like like really why is that that much type of thing you know cool and yo i don't want to show a picture ish but i'll show a picture i'll show you like what i got the first time versus what i got the second time Mara, do you see what I was dealing with? Can you just see? I was very annoyed because it didn't even taste the same. It tasted like it was two, from two completely different provinces. Not the same branch, not the same restaurant. If they're branches, I don't know. I was so mad. Yo! I went on Instagram, I found him. I think it's, I met the owner at that place, like, indirectly. And, yeah. I went onto Instagram. I said DM. Hey, I said search button. I tapped. And then I found it. Then I said message. Yes, yes, I started typing. Woo! Carry yay! No, not like rude and everything, but like respectfully, obviously. But like I got my point across. I was like, uh, I'll even read what I said. Let me read what I said. Let me find it. Okay. So I said, uh, I sent a photo of that photo. And I said, this is what I ordered at this event. This is what I got the second time around when I ordered the exact same meal. Carry, I didn't even get chips. I got a patata. I got a potato with spice. I was so mad, bro. It's not that I don't like wages. I don't like wages. Yeah. Confusing, but understandable. <laughs> and it, I delivered everything via Mr. Delivery. But, like, who doesn't use Mr. Delivery or Uber Eats or whatever, you know? Yeah. And then I'm like, it is the same thing I ordered, but, um... 
oh and and then i said this is what i got it was delivered by mr delivery and then i'm like it it is the same thing but it was the it isn't the same thing but it was the exact order what i got is not the usual restaurant's name standard and i did not enjoy this meal at all so then they replied nah they said hi there you are 100 percent right like that 100 emoji this is not our standard please send us our um your contact details so we can make it up to you and we are sorry about letting you down who i send them and i tell them my sincerest uh i appreciate it you know um I said please and thank you. I stay ordering from here and I was just really disappointed this time around. Uh, details to add delivered too. So nice in the details. And then uh, I get a call the next day. Mara like at night. Like maybe like 7. I don't like receiving phone calls. That's the truth. I do not like phone calls. Especially when I don't know the number. Yo! Me I can look at the phone ring and go make a meal. I don't like phone calls. You need to, You can't just phone me. You need to ask me. You know? Like... If you've ever phoned me and I didn't answer, but you knew that I was on my phone, it's because you didn't book your call. Babes, in 2020, we get booked and busy. You must book me to talk to me on the phone. Because I... I'm not always in a good mood to talk, you know what I'm saying? Especially like when you're a bubbly person. Like, we have moods also. Like, I'm also a person now. Sharp. So then... Yeah, so then I get a call and I'm like, hello? Yeah? Okay. Hey, okay, thank you. I sincerely appreciate it. Like, thank you. My sincerest thank yous. <laughs> Bye. Shop. So basically, they said they're going to send me new food with their own personal driver on Tuesday. You see? You see where complaining gets you? You must just be honest, you know? Because there's even, like, I don't like with some, like, flying uh, companies, like, you know, like, um, Lufthansa, like, SAA, like, companies like that. I don't know if I should say flying companies, but yeah, those things. They're in Europe now. Ha, let me tell you. If your flight is delayed by a certain amount of hours, like three hours or four hours, you get compensated like 300 euros because of complaining. Complaining is power, I'm telling you. But obviously, don't be aggressive about it. Just be like gentle and be like, uh, I don't like this. I don't like it. Anyway, but uh, yeah, that's my new intro. In the comments down below, please, I'm asking you nicely. Those that have YouTube accounts, please comment down below how you feel about my new intro. Uh, do you, you know, just let me know, like, what are your thoughts on my new intro? And please let me know if you are voting, if you're already new, uh, if you're going to vote. Labo, yeah, sharp. And I actually want to do something in relation to the awards. I'd like to take a subscriber with me and, you know, make do a giveaway because I'm sincerely honored and I'm very grateful, you know. And guys, your YouTuber needs to win this, you know. Your YouTuber really needs to win this. We have to. Standard procedure, you understand? You don't understand. You need to be me to understand. But you are me because we are one. We are family. We are family. Okay, anyway. You can see I'm getting off topic. <laughs> but anyway, you guys, man. That is all for this video. I really, really hope you enjoyed this video. It's one of the first videos where I feel like I have to talk to you guys. You're not vlogging. I'm, I'm running. You know, like I'm busy. You know, stuff. But yeah. But uh, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, like I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Uh, give it a thumbs up if you haven't already. Give another thumbs up. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already subscribed. You feel me? And yeah, and comment, you know, engage, you know, share with some people, show them, hey, hey, bra, my favorite YouTube, hey, she got nominated. Bitter and that bitter cool, I bitter neighbor. I vote because of milk. She's within and she's winning. Period. Right. Cool. So, guys, I will put the details for the voting and everything in the description box down below. Okay? <laughs> yeah, and then I also put the, like, the hair company that sent me this amazing wig. I don't lie, I feel like this is one of the, the prettiest short wigs on you and like, I don't know, I'm over like, you know, like curly hair and stuff like that and black hair. Like, I like color, you know me, like, DF. Okay, yeah. But uh, yeah, anyway, guys, uh, bye. See you in my next video. Mwah.